but just having some familiarity there with like what his options are to kill with Snake or what his options are to like zone yeah. or combo with Snake, that means he now has that knowledge to play the defense against Snake. So we'll see. Already 52%. We're not yeah, even 10 he seconds he in. He got a grenade trade. <laughs> he got a grenade um, extension on his combo, too. Bruh. All right. That's so like the last thing something we might see more of. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Dude, of all on. people to pull a bomb against, it's Snake. It's Snake, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yo, you got explosives? I'll show you explosives. Oh, yeah. Razo is definitely hitting Snake exactly where he should. But, oh, my goodness. Grenade into the up air. That's so much damage and knockback. Yeah, Scat Damn. already brought this back and took the lead even. Shooting Nikita. Incredible how often you can just shoot Nikita, cancel it, shoot it again. Like, yeah. That's a fast move. Oh, he's crazy with Ooh. these hits. His CQC is incredible. I thought he was going for, like, Nair to up tilt, but he goes for, like, jab one instead. Uh-oh. I like that he goes for Oh. No, he's dead. He's not dead. But oh, no, oh, he is he's dead. He's totally dead. Nikita, the best the Nikita edge guard sniper. in the world. That's definitely getting touched in 4.0. <laughs> <laughs> like, dude, it, oh, oh, all right. Uh, another homie stock. Scat, dude. Scat is he really, definitely the homie. He right really now. loves to have tight matches. He doesn't want to really loves to play Smash anyone. 4. He just wants to play a two stock, six minute game, you know? That's where he feels most comfortable. Big damage. He's going to go high. Razo can easily chase this if he yeah, wants to. Yeah, he didn't, though. But he opted it. reverse. In. Yo, that was clean. Oh, he's going crazy. Nice yeah. choice to go for the throw. Well, I don't know why he picked up the grenade there. Yeah. Might have been, okay. May have been an accident. Two stocks apiece. Relatively wow. even percents here. Razo off stage. Here oh, come the up goodness. smashes. So much pressure. But he gets his back air out in time to get through everything. Yeah, and interestingly enough, too, with the uh, up smash being out there, it prevented Razo from actually chasing down uh, Scat. So it just oh, made up. my God. It caught the spot dodge. That side B is so strong. That's uh -oh. so good. Okay, F tilts him out of the combo string. Ooh, big trade. He's okay. It doesn't matter. Only at 33%. Not going to die to that C4. Oh my goodness, he, trying to approach him with the mortar in front of him is just not a good idea. That was smash hitbox is insane. Okay, forward throw here. Yeah, you also recognize where the C4 is a lot of times. Nice. Goes high. All right, nice. Oh, wow. what an answer. He's not, oh, he is dead. What the heck? Nice. He definitely could have lived that. Yeah. He did not try to DI that it, at it all. It looked like no DI. In, yeah. Like, straight up. <laughs> like, it wasn't even bad DI, just no DI. Yeah, he's like, all right, I'll, I'll die here. Why not? All right. Game one going to Razo in the best of five. I guess, uh, I don't know. I wonder what it will take for Scott to go Mega Man here. He probably had to get completely body with Snake. Be, yeah, down 2-0 at least. That was only the first game. He did actually have control of the pace of the match uh, from the start. Actually, no, I take that back. Razo did like 60% in 10 yeah. seconds. <laughs> but then he, he, he oh, turned okay, it Mega around. Man. Mega he Man's already around. here, though. Okay. I like this. I think uh, Mega Man, at least from what I knew in Smash 4, I thought Mega Man like, did pretty, pretty decent. With the exception of like... Mega Man trying to get back to the stage, like Peach could just like down air the ledge and just keep him there. But otherwise, like you could definitely box box out Peach. Yeah, I think he just wants to frustrate uh, Razo yeah. a lot with these women while he's trying to just float in the air where he wants to be. Yeah, kind of just uh, take down Razo's defenses, get him to come to him, and then tear him apart piece by piece. Not gonna be an easy thing to do though. Razo, uh, once he feels comfortable versus you, he just gets all his damage. Yeah. That's kind of like a double edged sword with Mega Man, right? Oh my god, dude. That was so scary. That's a really good shield break setup, too, because if you just try to block the crash bomb while yes. you get F Smash, that's a free shield break. Yeah, you take the shield damage from the crash bomber and then, of course, from the F Smash as well, popping that bubble right out. 123 here for oh. Razo, gets the counter in. I can never tell when Rob was going to go for the counter. But he knows. Oh, snap. Right. Oh, my goodness. Didn't care anything about that leaf shield. 
drops on fair, taking the stock. See if Roswell can build his lead here. Stick out the ledge a little bit. Okay. Where's Scott going to take him, though? Oh. We're still living. 148. Oh, man. Roswell. Okay, he didn't really get a big combo string like he was wanted, but, uh, man, he's really good at... Oh, no, 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 oh, no. Dude, yo, I swear, I feel like he could have died off that. Yes, off I've seen that happen before. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't seen it happen in this game, but yeah, I know it's still possible. It's still in there, yeah. Yeah, he does the rush to like make you jump on top of it at the top, and then he just keep, uh, hits you with the up air. He's got the bag of tricks, man. Yeah, you gotta have tricks playing this character. Nice, another forward air. Whoa, what a good catch! Okay, Razo. Really playing smart around with Mega Man right now. I kind of didn't expect him to do this well against Mega Man just because I don't see him play against yeah. that many Mega Mans, really. It's like, it, 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 as far as like matchup familiarity, he's definitely more familiar against uh, Snake. We have more of those than we have Mega Man, so. You know, our like premier Mega Man w once upon a time was so Sonic yeah. Mega. He's, he's kind of inactive. He's doing his thing, though. Yeah, really uh, glad to have a famous voice actor be yes. the family father of MSM. Yeah, and uh, MM Leo, of course, is out here, but th they are pretty far away from each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, this is Crash Bomb set up here. Oh! Oh, my goodness. Bro, okay. The wall jump fair, that was so clean. That was sick. Yeah, really good edge guard. <laughs> These pellets, dude, it's just like, yeah. it's so funny to see, like, Razo throw out a move and the animation just get cut short. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. Gotta hold all the leaf shield too. That's a lot of damage too. Yeah, it it does up to twenty. Ooh. Oh, so if turnips, the longer they stay out, the more uh, powerful they are. So if you do like a really far snipe, you can actually get rewarded for hitting it. <laughs> oh my goodness, he's just trying to get in, but he's having to hit get, uh, deal with these pellets every single time. Okay. Carries one hit of the leash shield. Down throw to back air. Razo uh -oh. down air. Okay. He got sent too far for the forward air to connect, but that was a really good opportunity for him to uh, rack up the percent. Oh. Nice. Beautiful conversion there. Uh oh. What's he going to do with this? Oh, oh my. Dude, what? what? All right. Uh, You're crazy. No, yo. What? He, had, he calculated that. Yeah, he did. Oh, uh, he, he deserved that. That's crazy. Damn. But there's a forward smash. Oh, Mega oh, Buster to the rescue. Yeah, uh, he earned that game, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually mad that didn't hit. But, like, we saw it. We knew what he was doing. Yeah. Like, how do you even come up with that stuff? That's <laughs> Mega Man main thing. That's <laughs> like, crazy. Bro, you were off stage. You threw a crash bomber towards and then, like, upbeat into a back air. Like, what? Yeah. How do you even know that happens? Uh, you play the you play this character a lot. Yes. <laughs> you play this character a lot. Hey, man, down to the wire so far, one to one. Uh, definitely a much different game for Razo there. Having to adjust to the Mega Man, definitely. He he did pretty well, but it's it's rough because it's like those pellets, they're just, they just can't keep harassing you and harassing you. And yeah. It's like. Yeah, it's uh, definitely a really good counter to how Razo wants to play. Again, it's kind of similar to what happened with Charlie in the Snake matchup. Yeah. Is he's also a player that you know wants to get his buttons yep. or like wants to get these combos. But yeah. you're playing a matchup where he can just kind of slow you down. Yeah, the pellets almost just completely negate any sort of like aggressive pressure like that. Yeah, and then uh, you're kind of forced to play the game that Scott wants to play, or rather just adapt to it. Yeah, tough but not impossible. You can see Razo already showing a little bit of the adaptation right here, keeping Scat by the ledge, catching the roll onto the stage with the down smash, continuing to rack up this damage. He's got to be careful by the ledge here, though. Back air can definitely chain into itself at these uh, lower presents. What a parry on that counter. That was, like, the best way you could punish that. Okay, he's trying to get in, but nope. Scat just walls him out with every opportunity he has. Oh, missing a grab, very crucial at this point in the game. You don't want to give him oh a free opportunity God, to punish dude. you. 
He goes so deep on he stage. He went out there. Yeah. There's another forward air not going to kill. Uh, forward air is actually, like, such a good tool in this oh. game now, too. Yeah. Being able to kill now, and, yep. uh, it definitely helps out. And having very little inning lag, too, or landing lag. Yeah. Forward throw, not going to be enough. Oh, okay, Leaf Shield coming out in the nick of time to avoid getting KO'd by that turnip. First stock means so much in this match. Yeah, both players in dangerously red percent. Ooh. He gets snatched out of the air. Fourth throw not going to be enough. But he lets him set up with the, well, the crash bomb again? Yo, oh that my killed God. him. He, he buffered an air dodge out of the parasol and yeah. fell to his death. Yeah, he was so scared of the crash bomb setting him up. Yeah, he, he was uh, ready to, like, tech the crash bomber on the stage, but it actually didn't even put him into a tech situation. So. 200% for Scat wow. here. Catches the turn up. That's just so, so um, that's experience from the Mega Man Ditto there. When they try to throw the metal blade yeah. off, you off stage oh, and yeah. just catch it. Easy. Dash attack and to do the trick. I mean, at 200%, yeah, if anything. It if it didn't kill at 206, anything. I would have been very sad for Razo. Sad life. So about 70% to make up for here. Finds one back air. Just gently puts a dent in his armor. Oh. Oh my goodness, the chase is real, dude. Oh my He's going God, so dude, far. That so nasty. That's so crazy. What? Dude, dude the was rush just, was insane. He was just sharking below him. He was oh like, not God. yet, not yet, not yet. Here we go. That's and just so like crazy. that. He's up two stocks to one. I can't believe he went that far. That was insane. Nice. Playing around the counter as well. Ra Razo is uh, looking kind of lost in this matchup right now. For real. Oh, my goodness. Gets the pellet right into the easy grab. He's not letting him float where he wants, dude. He, every time he tries to float above him, he gets hit by a pellet. It looks tough, man. This is like, what, what are you supposed to do? Especially because, like, approaching with uh, aerials is, like, a strong option for, for Peach. It's just like, oh, my God. Man. Wow, that it hurt. Intercepted him, intercepted him immediately with the forward air. That's looking good, man. Yeah, man. It's like Pellet just kind of negates any sort of approach that Peach wants to make. I mean, she can, even if she wanted to side B, like Pellet's going to stop you. Try to forward air, Pellet's going to stop you. Nair, Pellet's going to stop you. Like, you got to you gotta kind of come, like, the best option for Razo is to kind of come at Mega Man from like above or behind him, but it's like, just think about how hard it yes. is to even do that. Yeah, like, he has up air as well. Yeah, up air is gonna cover any like approach from the from the top, sure. I'm telling yeah, you, I mean, to, I, I, I thought this Mega was a good Man. match of, for Mega Man in Smash 4 when I was playing him, yeah. so like, it's definitely rough. One game away from moving on to the losers finals, getting the rematch against Nico. I know he definitely wants the opportunity to do that. Same thing with Razo, though. I know Razo also has some trouble with Nico, too. Uh, you even said he's picking up Snake, potentially, to deal with that matchup. But he has to get through Scat before he can even think of doing that. And he has this Yoshi's Island Brawl counter pick. Let's see if he can use the stage to his advantage. Yeah, maybe potentially get some earlier KOs here with the small blast zones. Then again, uh, Mega Man can do the same thing, and back air, forward air, are both gonna kill much earlier. Yep. Oh my god. Nice. Taking advantage of the crash bomb there. Oh my goodness, what a clank. Rouse was throwing out all the smash attacks. Oh. Bro. Dang, that auto, he auto canceled that down air into an immediate back air, right? Rouse. There's the forward air. Early Showing some kill. signs of life. Yeah, early kill is going to be crucial for Razo. Uh, he's going to want to extend this lead as much as possible. Can be tricky, though. The way he's really going for these down airs. Dude, hard knuckle. I mean, it, it sends a message, and if you do it from a good, like a high enough distance that it just auto cancels over here. Yeah. We saw before. Razo turned up a little bit here. Goes high. Oh, the parasol. I, I respect it. <laughs> Interesting angle of the metal blade. Nope. Again, these downers are just not connecting, but he gets another back air to send him off the stage. I think the angle of 
the lip of the stage actually helps him avoid the forest smash because he can duck under it a little yeah, bit. Yeah, that makes sense. Definitely throws off like uh, projectile zoning just a little bit. Going again, going for that crash bomb setup. Oh, nice down smash. Okay. Again, he's just really aggressive from the ledge. He throws a forward air so often, but he hardly ever gets punished for it. 91% here for Scat, yet to take this first life. He does so with the back throw. Yeah, Scat kind of uh, calling out that over-aggression from Razo. Nice, not getting off the stage. What can he do to edge guard, though? He has to worry about the crash bomb every single time. Oh, that's something interesting, too. He can actually put the uh, crash bomber on the floor of the stage because of how uh, the uh, stage is angled. Oh, so, yeah, you're right. Yeah, he ju that we just saw that just now. So interesting. Oh, my. What? If he got the metal blade to back air. I'm not even sure how that back air missed. <laughs> I saw it, like, phase through Peach. Yeah, yeah, that was weird. It was like the bottom part of the yeah. back air just didn't connect or something. But now this has gotten dangerously close. Back throw, yeah, pretty much even game right here, especially even if uh, Scat is in a dangerously Ooh. high percent. Forward throw does it. I haven't seen that kill in a very long time. Yeah. Yoshi's oh. Island. Yeah, well, Yoshi's Island for the rescue. Yeah. I wonder what he banned. I don't know. I don't. I don't think this stage is legal where uh, Scat's Scat is from. from. Yeah. So he might not be super familiar with the stage. Yeah, man, we need to get it together as a Smash community. <laughs> I don't, li I don't like that. Like every region has a different like rule set. It's yeah, like, it's hard for everyone to agree. But there's a forward smash. Fifty-six, not too bad. This guy can definitely bring this one back. Yeah, I mean, All this right. is definitely like doable for Scott. Oh, dare wow. forward smash or sorry, forwarder. Again, catching the turn up easily off oh, stage, but he got sniped a little bit. Yep. Oh my goodness. Nice. The slight snipe of the turn up put him in a really poor position to recover. And got the, the golf swing. Rather than bring it to a game five. Really good counter pick, it seems. That definitely helped him out. Yeah, definitely, like I said, it me messes up the uh, projectiles a little bit because if you're if you are standing, I think, in the very center of the stage and you shoot a cross bomber uh, out. I think it ends up getting stuck on right. the on the on the floor of the stage. So yeah, he used his really good counter pick just to stay alive in the set, so we won't be seeing that anymore. Battlefield's the final game of the set here, and let's see who gets to move on to losers finals versus Nico. Both these guys want a, a, a shot at Nico too. So Snake's back on Battlefield, one of Snake's best stages. It's really hard to catch his landings. And uh, challenge him when he's on the platform with the, like holding a grenade. Interesting that I went back to the snake. Yeah, it's a really good snake stage, so yeah. not super surprised. But Razo did uh, do really well against the snake before, so we'll see. All right, and then I mean Razo, you know, PR'd in SoCal, very talented in his own right. But Scat on the PGR, newly yeah. minted. So if Brazo's able to take this in the game five, it's gonna, gonna be a nice win under his belt for sure. Yeah, if it counted. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it'll count for the PR at least. Yeah, for this PR, yeah. for SoCal PR. It's gotta be big points. Yeah, already having a big win on Larry tonight. Another one on Scott. Definitely would be really good for him. But uh, Scott's making it really rough. Nice tech chase. Ooh, just barely not Oh, dying. my goodness. So when you uh, hit the, uh, the Nikita, you're normally yeah. supposed to be able to cancel out the hitbox of it. But then he just side beat again right into the Nikita and died for it. Unfortunate for Scott. Or sorry, for Razo. Yeah, absolutely. So Scott taking that first stock. Trying to rack up some more damage. Falling out of the grab. Razo getting one of his own, pulling a turn up. Nice catch. He's still staying alive though, but he's keeping him in disadvantage where he wants him. Nice turn up recatch. Oh, oh, barely missing that forward air. I'm surprised he didn't go for a back air there. It's like yeah, into the stage. Yeah. Maybe he was scared of a tech situation, but. Oh, this forward air trade is 
Going to be enough to take the stock, but man, he took so much percent. Yeah, 77, man. And Peach is not as heavy as Snake is. I catch him in shield with the shield poke, but Scott's playing super well right now defensively. It's really hard to get in on this guy. Look at all these C4s everywhere. Oh, there it is. Oh, C4 my goodness. exploding. He just was so lenient with that, too. He blew up C4 after C4. Yeah, he's just really good at catching people with it. Oh, my goodness. Grenade into the dash attack. That's 24%. Oh, my goodness. Catching Razo with all these explosions right now. Oh, my. Got him again. Dude, his, his projectile play right now is insane. Oh, C4 again? Ooh. Yeah, he drifted away from it this time to avoid getting caught. But still, really uh, good lead right now for Sky. He's not going to die anytime oh soon. Oh, my God. Dude, I was so scared that Razo rolled to the left there because the C4 was in place. Fortunately, the roll uh, didn't have enough distance that should get to the C4. Oh. Oh, my goodness. The grenade saving his recovery. Scott is just racking up all this percent. Oh, oh there, there it is. There it is yep. again. C4 stick, back throw, down B, another one. Really smooth gameplay from uh, Scott. It looked like 